The sculpture you were looking at drew ridicule and shame when the artist first exhibited it in 1913. Nearly a century later, Symphony No. 1 is considered a pivotal example of abstract sculpture. Your immediate reaction might be to dismiss this work, just as your boss dismissed you after making what anyone would agree was an honest mistake. But if you allow yourself to really look at this piece, you'll see that it awakens all senses simultaneously. Remember the labored walk of a man in the subway and the steady rhythm of the train. Then the taste of Ellie's lips together with the softness of the blanket and the sound of your friend's laughter. Life is a constant clashing and combining of perceptions, Frank. And maybe this is what the artist, Baranoff Rossine, tried to convey in his work. But at the time, it was so experimental and unappreciated that the artist took a sculpture similar to the one you're looking at and threw it into the River Seine. He was so discouraged that he wanted the water to swallow up and corrode his vision. But later he went back and recovered his work. Why? Because somewhere in the back of his mind, he had a lingering hope that someday, someone would feel what he felt, see what he saw.